There was a time about 15 years ago where if you peeked inside the bags of many prominent PGA Tour players like Ricky Fowler, Anthony Kim, and several others, you would have found some Adams hybrids discreetly cucked underneath the head covers of the golf equipment companies that those players were being paid to endorse. Well, Adams was purchased by TaylorMade Adidas Golf in 2012, and many of the technologies and features that were in those clubs slowly made their way into TaylorMade stuff. And over time, the Adams brand sort of faded into the background. However, now in May of 2023, Adams is back with a whole new rebranding, a new logo, new irons, and a brand new way of purchasing Adams equipment. So the obvious question is, who is Adams Golf actually gonna be making this golf equipment for? Lots of people have discovered since 2020 the golf is really fun. It's a great way to get outside, to hang out with friends. It's a way to get your competitive edge going. It's great. And those players who started playing golf and discovering the game during the COVID-19 pandemic and the years that followed, many of them actually borrowed clubs. They've talked to friends who maybe had some hand-me-down stuff. Maybe some of them bought some used golf equipment. Players like that are now ready to make their first meaningful purchase of golf equipment. You know, this is golf equipment that is meant to be played by people who are falling in love with the game. It's also golf equipment that is meant to be for people who remember Adams. So let's talk about the clubs. I'm going to begin with the driver. If you look down, you're going to see a very large carbon fiber crown. It's got a 460 cc volume head it has a titanium face it has a titanium body on the bottom of the club you're going to see a large velocity slot which is going to help to enlarge the sweet spot of the variable thickness face you're also going to notice there's a carbon fiber panel that's going to be out in the toe section as well as a precision draw weight that's going to be in the heel now when you move into the fairway woods as well as the hybrids you're going to see many of the same technologies and features that were in the driver there's going to be large carbon fiber crowns on both the fairway woods and the hybrids you're going to notice there's a very large velocity slot slot that's designed into the fairways and hybrids. Again, it enlarges the sweet spot. It's going to help to make the lower portion of the face a lot more active, which is going to be especially helpful for players when they're hitting off the deck because it's going to activate the lower portion of the hitting area. The Adams Idea irons are going to look like a traditional game improvement club, and that's, again, by design. Golfers who are relatively new to the game, somebody who's coming back to the game, they don't want to stand out. They don't want to have golf equipment that looks like, hey, I'm a beginner. I just went ahead and bought something here. Look at me. This is an iron that's going to blend in. It's going to look very, very modern. It has a hollow body design that's going to help to make the face flex a little bit more efficiently at the moment of impact to give you more distance. It also has a very low center of gravity to help the ball get up in the air a lot more easily. The trisole design is going to help to work through the turf, so if you do hit the ball a little bit fat, making contact behind the ball in the ground rather than ball first, it's going to help to work through that turf and help you maintain speed through the hitting zone. When it comes to the wedges in the Adams Idea set, this is where some real innovation has been cooked in. When you look down in the address position, you're gonna see a relatively traditional looking wedge. Maybe it has a slightly higher toe than some wedges, but it's not, it, it wouldn't stand out as a high toe wedge. However, when you flip the club over, you're going to notice that there's a very large undercut cavity behind the leading edge. That removes a tremendous amount of weight, which was then put around the perimeter. It is a cavity back wedge. There's also extra mass that's been positioned high up here in the toe area. That's going to help to elevate the center of gravity position, and that's going to help players try and drive their wedge shots a little bit more piercingly. It's going to create a little bit lower ball flight. They're offered in two different lofts with 54 and 58 only. You're not going to have a full gamut of wedge lofts available in the Adams Idea set. But again, this player really isn't looking for that. This is something simple. It's fairly basic. But I'll tell you what's not basic is going to be the sole configuration here. It's a pretty aggressive C grind with a lot of material removed from both the heel and the toe area here. This golf club is going to be something that will grow, I think, with a lot of different players. You can certainly play it from a square position, but as a player gets more and more comfortable around the greens and wants to open up the golf club to be able to expose a little bit more loft, to be able to work some shots and add some variety, completing the new offerings. Adams has also brought out a pair of putters that for a lot of people who've been playing golf for a while are gonna look very, very familiar. The Adams C Groove Prospect and Madison. Both of these putters are made out of 303 stainless steel, but the real story when you look down is going to be the addition of the C Groove face. This is something that was a classic back about 10, 15, 20 years ago. Many players love the way that those grooved faces made the ball roll a little bit more consistently, soaked up a little bit of the vibration and helped to improve performance, give a little more consistency on the greens. Again, these are gonna be putters that have a very traditional look. We've all seen classic answer style blades like this, this fang style mallet that's relatively compact. The prospect is gonna have a little bit of toe hang, so it should help to reward players that have a slightly arc stroke. The Madison, on the other hand, has a single bend shaft, and as you can see, this is a face balanced offering, so players that have a slightly more straight back, straight through stroke will probably be rewarded by this one. Now, I've been telling people for years that it really is important to get custom fit, but you have to, again, think about who Adams is gonna be really targeting with this type of product. 
many people just simply like to buy things online. They are used to going to sites like Amazon and simply making their purchases and then expecting things to be able to get returned. That isn't traditionally the way that it works with golf equipment. However, it will with this. Each of the Adams Golf Clubs is going to be sold with a 60-day money-back guarantee. So if you go out and try a new driver or fairway wood or some of the putters and find that they don't work for you, you're going to be able to return it within two months. If you find that you bought a driver that has a stiff shaft, but you want to go down to a regular flex shaft, you'll be able to return it and get the new shaft brought in. So if you're a person who's new to the game, you're looking to make your first meaningful investment in the game of golf, or you're somebody who's coming back to golf, you remember the Adams products and you're curious, you might want to head over to adamsgolf.com and learn a little bit more.